So today I'm playing Fallout 4 and I'm here with another settlement build, quote unquote, because today I'm here with the home plate, more of a decor than an actual build. There's not a lot you can do with the settlement, but I had some fun with it and gave it a little theme, which I will show you in a second. So uh, without further ado, I have to be honest and say I have borrowed some of this design from a whole bunch of other home plates I've seen, starting with this little sleeping area, which I tried my best to make private with these little hanging buoys. Everything's very PG, nothing, nothing out of the ordinary here. Just some knives and oil, it's fine. Backsplash is just a combination of a bunch of pictures. Oh, nothing to see here. Just a suitcase underneath there for my clothing. Shotgun in my hat, kind of come here and unwind. Again, nothing really out of the ordinary to see here. Bat for intruders, just in case, even though I have a gun. Underneath my bed is a safe with all my belongings. And to the corner is a bit of an office space with my one and only institution flag that I have remaining. As you can see I'm a bit of a drinker. Treasures of the Jamaican Plain. Cat bowl. And underneath the stairs is kind of fun because you can actually insert, I guess, the shelves into this space slightly. So I can make a three-tiered little bar shelf, I guess, for my Vim and Nuka-Cola Quantums. And Dog Meat's little place. I always make sure there's somewhere for him and a cat if they ever try to come. Next is the crafting area. You can't really do anything but make this a crafting area because that's where the workbench is. Um, so I've tried to light it up a little bit more and create also a wall with the light boxes there. But the actual wall here that you see with the painting is the weapon rack display which form nice walls because he, it, for this settlement you can't build any walls of your own. I tried to go with uh, more of a dim lighting so that was really difficult to get right and I, I don't I don't think I did get it right, but uh, I tried. So here it is. The electrical I didn't really spend a lot of time on either. So next I'll bring you into what is essentially, I guess, like a sitting room slash living room. Pretty basic. There's some board games there. There's the TV area, some more captain's blend, and a very small collection of books, which are actually magazines. Some super cool armor rack display, and obviously Django's the monkey watching television upside down like a fool. Okay, so I'll take you into the next room. Oh, and there's another shotgun, some cigarettes, and a telephone. And this is the bar area. I'll explain the table in a sec. Bar area, little shoot some hoops. There's a basketball. Game of chess is about to start over there, clearly. Someone's having uh, some sugar bomb cereal with whiskey, which is a good alternative if you don't have milk. Here's just a little bar. <coughs> and the kitchen, very basic. Someone's having a great meal. Just some kitchen stuff. I love this little clock. I try to use it as much as I can. Eat omatic there. Okay, so now I'll take you to the money table. So if you haven't clued in yet, I went with the theme that this is kind of a, a trap house or a chem house. 
so as you can see my wanderer is busy collecting and counting all his money and weighing it to make sure he's not being uh, being toyed with I used to have a pool table in this room, but then I got rid of it, but that's why she's holding this pool cue. Thought I'd keep it though. Without further ado, I'll take you upstairs to show you a bit of the main event. Hazardous materials. So upstairs is where all the cooking happens, clearly. And if you get really tired, you can just sleep in a sleeping bag once you're done. Some coolers up there. This is apparently what goes into making chems. There's the station in its entirety. Some guns on the wall. A little sink for an eye wash. Also some ingredients over there. And upstairs is inevitably the bathroom where someone has been unwinding with a nice bath and some some beer bottles. <laughs> the TV in there just in case you want to watch the one channel and continue to stand by just in case. Little kitty. Some toilet paper and soap and obviously more whiskey. So yeah about all there is. It is a very small settlement, but I enjoy decorating it. You can't get super crazy with it, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed and uh, hopefully I'll be back with more soon. All right, thanks. Bye.